so you're an expat in Europe and you're here to either study or you're already having a job and you're working full time and you want to start investing some money in the stock market because whatever money that you have lying on your bank account, it's just losing its power to inflation. So in order to invest your money in the stock market, you need a broker like Scalable Capital. I have been using Scalable Capital since 2020 and I have now over 200,000 euros in my stock portfolio there and I've had a very good experience so far. So with so much experience and trying so many different kinds of things with the broker and having made my experiences with that, I want to make this step-by-step -step video so that you're able to understand how do you use your scalable capital broker and what are the costs involved with that and everything around it. So that towards the end, you have a very good idea and you can start investing in the stock market too with your scalable capital broker. The link for opening the broker you will find in the description below. When you go to the scalable capital website, you will find that they have multiple options. So when you go to the this globe button, you will see you have Germany, Austria, Italy, France and Spain. This means if you're from any of these countries, you are able to use scalable capital as your broker to invest in the stock market, which is very convenient. This also is very nice because in case you decide someday that you want to not just live in Germany, you want to move to any other EU country, you can also take your broker with you in any of the other countries which are not even mentioned on this page. So as long as they're part of the EU and as long as there are direct SEPA debits available, you can do that very easily. When I moved from Germany to Romania, I was able to carry my scalable capital broker with me. So all I had to do was change the details inside the app, let the customer support know that I'm moving and link my new bank account. And that was pretty much it. It was a very simple process. And that was such a relief that I do not have to now sell my positions and maybe buy them new on some other broker or something that I can just simply carry my broker anywhere I want to go within EU. Now, if you take a look at the website, it pretty much already tells you what the idea is that investing has changed and start today with scalable capital broker and invest in stocks, ETFs and crypto. For those of you who are new, ETFs are a collection of different kind of companies. That means if you are investing in one share of that ETF, you're investing in multiple different kind of companies. Many of the ETFs are also based on indexes, for example, S&P 500. That means when you're buying one share of S&P 500, you're investing in the 500 companies underlying that index. Now, investing with scalable capital is actually like pretty simple. They also have very good ratings from most of the review platforms. When you go to broker on the first tab, you will see the different kind of plans available. You have the free broker. That means you are not paying any kind of monthly or yearly fee whatsoever. There are no startup fees anyway. So it's free for you. And especially when you just simply want to passively invest in the stock market, that means you set up a savings plan. A savings plan is an automatic function with the help of which you're investing in the stock market in the index fund that you chose every single month. So the money is directly debiting from your current account and it's getting invested and you don't have to worry about anything at all. This is very convenient for people who don't want to like, you know, actively buy and sell things. And they say, okay, I want to like invest in this index fund. I want to do it for the next 10, 15 years. And the money is directly deducting from your current account and it's getting invested there. And you can also cancel it anytime. And this is completely for free as long as you're choosing the prime partners. What are the prime partners? Prime partners are Xtrackers, Invesco and iShares. Then the second plan that you have is the prime broker. I'm using prime broker and you will see it when I will show you my dashboard. So here, for example, you have all of the free features. Of course, you can invest in a lot of different kinds of securities which are available on the broker and you are having commission free uh, buying and selling in the free broker plan. Every single time you buy a stock or you buy an ETF or you buy crypto and so on, you're paying 99 cents as a commission. And when you're selling, you're also paying the same. When you're running savings plan on prime partners, you're not paying any kind of money for that at all because it is completely automatic. If you're choosing the prime broker, which is two euros 99 per month and you pay it annually. So it comes to around 35 euros and 88 cents. With that, you don't have to pay any kind of commission whatsoever, as long as the purchase volumes are above 250 euros. If it's below 250 euros, it's 99 cents. Most of the times you're just simply making a savings plan. So when you're making a savings plan, you can do it both for an ETF or for some of the selected stocks. And again, you're not paying anything at all. The people who are doing a lot of trading for them, prime broker is interesting. And for the people who are not doing so much trading and they just want to passively invest in the stock market, 
free broker is completely fine. Now, of course, some interesting features are that you have different kind of options available on all of the platforms. So you can use it on your web and app, iOS and Android, which is uh, very nice. You also have dynamic charts in the dashboard and you can also see any kind of price alerts that you have set up. Now, making an account is very easy because all you have to do is you have to click on open account and with here, you have to put your email address inside and once you put your email address inside, you will get a link on your email address with which you're able to finish the sign up process. It's very, very simple. And once you have opened your account, you are able to log in directly here. And when you log in, a screen like this shows up. This is my portfolio. And here I have 229,000 euros. And of course, like many of us know that the stock market is taking a heavy beating right now. But this also means that many of the good companies are available at very good prices. So you can buy them cheap and then you can you know someday sell them at a higher price so this is how the dashboard looks like and here you're seeing how much value you're having in your portfolio you can also change different kind of rooms so you can do for one day one week one month one year and since purchase so then afterwards you can see what kind of positions you have so i have amd i have a etf which is this iShares core msci gold and this is a prime etf and it is denoted here with b so you can directly see it's a prime product and you can invest in these etfs without any kind of costs whatsoever and this is also heavily diversified with msci gold you're investing in 23 developed markets and you're investing across 1500 companies so your risk is very diversified so then you have nvidia we have palantir technologies and tesla also if you want to invest in crypto you can do it directly from your scalable capital broker the options you have is bitcoin ethereum cardano ripple and solana so these are also available then you're also having the option of having a watch list so if you find some stocks interesting you can just click on them and then afterwards you can put a star sign and with this it goes into the watch list so you can like keep a track if there are some kind of good prices available you can do that you can also set up a price alarm by just simply clicking on this bell button and say okay like if it goes minus five percent i want to receive an alarm so you can then click on activium and then you have to turn on the notification up top okay that's very important otherwise you won't get the notification also on the phone make sure that the notifications are turned on for your scalable capital app otherwise you don't get the price notification so you have to click on allow and then that's pretty much it you can also deactivate it very easily just by clicking on this bin icon and it's done so then you close it and it's all good now that's the interesting thing that I find that let's say you really like a company and you want to set up a savings plan just for that particular company. So savings plan, not for an ETF, but for a particular stock. So you can do that very easily by clicking on gets Einrichten. Then you can say, all right, I want to invest 500 euros per month. And then you can uh, select the frequency, which is monthly, every two months, every three months. Then afterwards you can say, all right, what date of the month it should start at? You can also select this and then afterwards inflation shoots is uh, inflation protection so do you want to increase it by two percent every single year by three percent every single year by five percent every single year you can also do that um, or you can do it manually it's not such a important feature that i would like you know maybe break my head with this and then simply click on spa plan activion and that's it you're good to go and every single month at the date that you have given the money is going to be deducted from your current account and then it is going to be invested into the stock that you have chosen now cancelling it is also very very simple you don't have to fill out crazy amounts of paperwork for cancelling a savings plan you just have to quickly click on this icon again where it is showing this you know a recycle almost uh, icon you just have to click on this you click on uh, zero you can either click on zero or you can simply say power plan addition and this is done so you don't have to worry about anything and if you want to buy or sell or something again kaufen so you can say all right i want to buy like you know 1000 euros of something you can just click on order for Brighton, and then afterwards you can see all of the options you can put a stop or you can put a limit when you're purchasing and then you can buy it that way. it's also very easy so this is pretty much it it's very simple to use also when you want to use it over your phone it's also very convenient everything that i've told you here is just the same functions that you will also find on your phone the thing that i like about scalable capital is that because it is a german broker you don't have to do the tax filing for the stocks and etfs 
at the end of the year. Your tax filings for the stocks and ETFs is going to be directly submitted to the Finansamt wherever you are living in. So this is a very convenient option because otherwise your tax consultant is going to charge you extra money for doing all of these things. But with the scalable capital broker, you don't have to worry about the taxes part either. And for all of the other income, for example, salary or any kind of side hustle and so on, for that you contact your tax consultant and he is going to help you with that. Another important thing is sometimes your tax consultant might ask you for a report of you know the submission of the taxes and so on that you can also very easily find by going to the mailbox option here and there you will have the reports and the reports generally come around april uh, march to april of every single year for the previous year and of course the deadline for submitting the taxes is june july so you have plenty of time to submit the taxes in order so that is pretty much it it is very simple to start investing in the stock market when you're living in europe even as an expat coming from india from bangladesh sri lanka from any other eu country you don't have to worry about having different kind of hurdles when you want to invest in the stock market because all of this is done in a very simple way most of the times directly online and if you are from some of the countries where the online process does not work you just have to go to your local post office identify yourself and everything is done very smoothly anytime you have any kind of questions and stuff you can also reach out to the customer support they are also very helpful and in general because there is no opening fee there is no yearly fee and so on so you are in complete control anytime you want to close the account or something you can also do that very simply. If you want to move your broker from some other broker to Scalable Capital, I've also made a video about it. You can check that out. And if you want to watch the video on step-by-step -step how to open your depot with Scalable Capital, you can also find the link for that in the description below. Everything that I've talked about in this video, you'll find in the description. And if you have any kind of questions still, you can write in the comments and I'll respond to you there. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.